Let's get some more practice with the Fundamental Theorem of Calculus Part 2 by solving this definite integral. There's nothing to rewrite here, so we're just going to use this power rule for integrals to take the integral of each one of these three pieces. For the first term, we take the power of 2 and increase it by 1 and then divide by that same power. For the second term, we're doing the same thing. We're increasing our power from 1 to 2 and dividing by that 2. And the integral of 7 is just 7x. Technically, we are increasing the power from 0 to 1 and dividing by 1 there. And we're going to evaluate that whole polynomial between x equals 4 and 7. Let's simplify first. Okay, plugging 7 and 4 into this is not going to be the simplest thing, but I guess we can use our calculators. The fundamental theorem of calculus part 2 says we plug in this upper limit, and we get that right there, and then we subtract, and we plug in the lower limit. My calculator says that this first number here is 1911, and that the second number is 348, and if we subtract those two numbers, we get 1563 as our final answer. Again, what that represents is the area beneath this parabola between the x values of 4 and 7. Apparently that's a pretty big area. And a graph of this parabola would show you that it is a pretty big area. So, okay, good job. Uh, let's get some more practice on the next one.